Congratulations, Shelby, to your engagement to Josh. I am so happy for you. It's amazing to know that within a month, you're going to become Mrs. Josh Ford. It has been a joy to go wedding dress shopping with you, talking about your ideas and making plans for the wedding. May 28th will be a wonderful, joyous time, not only for us, but also for Josh's family. Congratulations again. I love you very much. And I wish you and Josh the very best. The best sister in TC anyone can ask for. I am so excited for you and Josh and your big day coming up, Shelby. I hope today you feel so showered with love. You and Josh are loved by so many. You guys work so well together. You guys are an amazing couple. And this upcoming wedding will be a special day filled with so much love. I love you. Can't wait to be right by your side. And, and I'm happy you're gonna marry Josh because you're the happiest girl I ever see. Hey Shelby, I just wanted to get on here and say that I'm super glad that you found somebody whose annoying level is something that you can tolerate. Um, I know that that's been a big deal and it's a rare find, so I'm glad you were able to find somebody. I'm glad that our family likes them considering he's gonna be hanging out with us for the next several years. I guess I just wanna say thanks for being the best cousin <laughs> ever. Um, it's really nice to have a built-in best friend, but somebody who would be your best friend anyway, without being your family, like that's not something everybody gets. So I've definitely been blessed to have that for however old you are, because I'm older. Um, obviously you've always been the life of the party and I love that about you. It's always just a great time. I don't know, I feel like I need to cut this off because you're probably getting a big head, so thanks for making my life better and a lot of other people's lives better also. So, bye! <laughs> Congratulations, Shelb. You will be the most beautiful bride. We are all so excited for you. Oh, okay, come on. You want in this too? Oh, Shelby, I just love you so much. What do I even say? I mean, just thinking back, like how our friendship has evolved over the years, it always makes me super grateful. You know, we were friends in high school from the same big group but we really didn't get close until college. And I loved having you as a roommate with Haley. I feel like that was the perfect little trio off campus. I felt like we lived really well together. And with you in particular, I just love how down you were to do anything like school spirit related and like going all out for basketball or football games. You were always my go-to to do stuff like that with. And I always loved that. But then, more than anything, I'm just so grateful for how our friendship has gotten even closer since college. Even though we live in different cities, I feel like you and I have really made an effort to keep up. Your drips to Chicago are short, but I always love just like getting down with you and Jade in like less than 24 hours when you come. And I feel like your biggest cheerleader, honestly, like I love having watched you grow so much and become just the most awesome school counselor. You just love those kids so much and you're so good at it. And I love how much you're just thriving now. You and Josh, I feel like it was immediately apparent that this was like a match for the long haul. The story is obviously so cute and I love that Bumble reached out to you to feature it. I'm just so excited to celebrate everything related to you and Josh. I hope um, you're enjoying this video of everybody gassing you up um because you deserve it and i'll see you in a few weeks love you say bye shelby hi shelby um 
I just want to tell you congratulations. I'm so excited for you. You and I go way back all the way to high school. We had some crazy times. Both of us made really silly decisions. We didn't miss a single basketball game or a football game for tailgating together. We are Northrop! We played softball. You stuck it out for those three years and, you know, I quit after one. We've just hung out all the time and did a lot of things. When we went to college, um, you know, we visited here and there and we kind of just always stuck to be friends. I feel like that just kind of shows what type of person you are. You are just so kind and caring. And even if we don't talk for weeks or months, we just kind of like click back to our lives like we we're best friends in high school. and. I really am like grateful for our friendship because I have a lot of many friends that I can say that I've been friends with for so long and literally it doesn't even feel like we are states away from each other. Um, another part of this video, I wanted to um, use my resources wisely and get a little laugh out of you. I asked my kindergartners if they had any advice for someone who's getting married, what they should do after they're married. I think they should kiss. Give them a ring. Josh already gave Shelby a ring. Um, what do you think they should do now that they're married? Uh, hug. Hug? You should okay. stay together. And walk your dogs together and get along. And like, watch TV together because my mom does that all the time with my dad. <laughs> <laughs> Say I love you. They should go to Disneyland. Well, at the wedding. They both sing, dance. They should dance together at the wedding? Yes. I've been to the wedding before with my friend Stella. You did? Yes. Be nice and cheerful. Take the dogs on walks. And they should go and see Santa. They should go see Santa together? Sleep together. Oh, sleep together? In the same bed? So I'm gonna marry someone, take the drive in a car and take our dogs in a drive. Oh, so when you marry someone you wanna drive in your car and Yeah. Oh. And give our dogs a drive. I love it. I hope you loved their advice just as much as I did. It gave me a little laugh. I love you, Shelby, and I wish you nothing but the best. I'm so happy for you and Josh, and I can't wait to spend the whole day with you in just like a month or so. Yay! Have fun today. Hey, Shelbs. I am so lucky to have met you during our college years. You are such a joy to everyone around you, and I'm so lucky to have you as one of my best friends. I am so happy for you and Josh and can't wait to celebrate together soon. If he can love you while you're eating sour Skittles, he can love you through anything. Love you so much. Hey Shelby, congratulations to you and Josh on your engagement. I'm so excited for your guys' big day. I'm just so thankful for all these years of friendship that we've had together over the years. Um, what I love so much about you is your ability to light up any room that you walk into. Your laugh is just so contagious and you always know you're gonna have a good time whenever you're with Shelby. Some memories that stand out the most over the years have just been any time we've been on a dance floor together. And I've always loved our shared obsession for a good Dr. Pepper. Um, some marriage advice I have for you and Josh is just to remember to always continue to date each other. And Josh, remember to always treat Shelby like the queen that she is. Shelby, you're gonna be the most stunning bride and I seriously cannot wait to celebrate you and Josh on your big day. Hi Shelby, um, first off congrats on the engagement. Um, I can't wait for your wedding day. It's going to be so much fun. You're going to look amazing um, and it's truly the start to an exciting um, journey together. So I, I couldn't be more happy for you both. When I think back on some of my favorite memories with you, um, I just think back to that time period of like high school and, and college and kind of growing up together. And I really cherish most of those memories, whether we were getting into fun or trouble. I'm just glad we didn't end up in, in jail or a hospital, <laughs> but it was so much fun. And I was, I'm so grateful that um, I got to call you my friend and still do. Um, I guess my, my advice to you moving forward in marriage is to focus on um, letting go of your pride 
and focusing on the intent of your partner. Those are two big things for me that help me get through uh, moments together with, with, with my marriage. So I hope that's helpful. Um, Shelby, I can't wait. I'm so excited and so, so happy for you. You truly deserve it. Um, I'll see you on their big day. Hey, Shelby. Congratulations on your engagement. I'm super excited for you and Josh. I think it's pretty special that you both have found somebody you'd love to annoy every day for the rest of your lives. Shelby, you've always been a great friend, and as everyone knows, you've always been the life of every party. You bring out the best in everyone. Josh, just remember to continue to bring out the best in Shelby. And Shelby, just remember, sometimes you will not be right, and when that happens, just apologize for it. And then hope Josh never brings it up again. Josh, don't ever bring it up again. One piece of advice I have for you guys is to always remind each other how much you appreciate and love one another. Most importantly, we're all super excited for your big day. Shelby, you are going to make the most beautiful bride and I can't wait to see you guys there. Congratulations, Shelby. I am so excited for you and Josh. You guys are so cute together, so hilarious. And I hope that you never move out of Fort Wayne so that we can still always hang out together. I know your wedding is going to be so much fun and I'm just so thankful that we have stayed friends all of these years since high school. I can't believe it's been this long. I love you so much and I cannot wait for your wedding. Congratulations, Shelby. I'm so excited for you and Josh. From the first time I met you at IU, I could tell how genuine and fun you are. Little did I know I would start dating and eventually marrying one of your good friends, which meant that I got to spend so much more time with you over the years and get to know just how wonderful you are. You're the life of every party. You make everybody's day brighter. But more than that, you're an incredibly selfless friend who's always there, no questions asked. You truly deserve the absolute best in life, and I know that you found that in Josh. It has been an honor getting to see your love grow over the last couple of years, seeing how well you guys complement each other and that you really are just meant for each other. I am so excited for you guys as you start this new chapter in your life, and I can't wait to see what the future holds. Love you guys. Hi, Shell. It's Hey. I just wanted to say I'm so excited for you, and I can't believe you're getting married and I can't wait to celebrate with you and Josh on your day. It feels just like yesterday we were sitting in pre-calc with Mr. Croft uh, and I told you I got my job at Subway. I think we were like 17 um, and then we were at my wedding and now I'm going to yours. It's crazy and I'm so excited for you and I can't wait for what life brings for you and Josh. Happy bridal shower day, and I love you. Congratulations. What's up, Shelby? Uh, just wanting to say congratulations to you and Josh. Um, I'm so excited to be a part of this love story for you guys. Um, I think Josh is an amazing, amazing man, and I couldn't be happier for you and the future that you guys are gonna experience and live together. I think it's gonna be so special and it's gonna be so amazing. And I just commend you, Shelby, for being the woman that you are for waiting for such a good man to come along and for being so true to yourself and for allowing that space for him to, to, to take part in your new life. Um, I had this whole big plan of like being out and about and you know, making this video and like cheersing you and like all that, but then I got drunk. So here we are the next morning. Um, I love you. I can't wait to celebrate you too. Um, I hope this time is, is everything that you've ever dreamed it to be. Love you, Shelby. Hey Shelby, happy bridal shower day. I'm excited that we actually get to celebrate you today and shower you with gifts because you're always doing that for everyone else. Um, I just wanna say that I feel like, although we've just been friends for a couple of years, that I've known you for much longer than that and I really hope that we stay friends for a lifetime. Um, a couple things that I especially appreciate about you is that we can have a blast doing nothing, like literally just sitting on the couch and talking for hours. Um, it doesn't have to always be this huge ordeal when we hang out. You are truly a one of a kind friend and the type of friend that does not come often. So I just want you to know that. 
um, and that we really appreciate you and love you and just are so happy for you because you deserve the world. I love that the theme of your party is tacos and margaritas because that's kind of our couple's tradition with the Joshes. And I hope that that's something that we continue on for years to come. Um, and congratulations to you and Josh. Can't wait to party at the wedding. Shall be, shall, Mrs. Forbes. Most importantly, Shelby. I'm so excited for you, dude. I'm so happy for you. Congratulations. I am so happy for Josh that he gets to spend the rest of his life with you. Shelb, you are such a wonderful human being. You are a bright light in so many people's lives. You are a super loyal, dedicated, true friend who is like the most hilarious person in the world, but also will totally be there for you in your darkest moments. And that is just golden, Shelby. And that's you. I love you so much, dude. I'm so proud of you. You're such an amazing school counselor. You touch so many lives with your passion for so many kids who experience so much love from you that they might not get. Um, in a lot of other places. So that's what's up, dude. I love you so much and you guys just deserve the best. And I'm going on for too long. I love you so much. Bye. Yes, Shelby and Josh, wish you the best. I'm so happy for both of you. Just get along. No fighting. That's my advice. Just have a happy marriage with your two little dogs. <laughs> love you. You know. No, they don't fight. They don't. No, you don't have to say that. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> do, do you ever have? Do you ever... They just love each other, right? Yeah. Hey, Shelby. Aunt Trisha here with a friend. Hey, we just wanted to send you a little message and tell you how happy we are for you. Um, we wish you nothing but happiness in your coming years with Josh. He's very lucky to have met you. And I think it's just amazing. How you um, I love you. I want you to know how special you are. You're a friend to so many. I mean, you've been in what, like 60 weddings or so? I don't know. But hey, just know how happy we are for you. I love you. I wish you nothing but joy and happiness because you deserve it. I love you. Bye. Go ahead, say it. Bye. Go ahead. Your turn. Hi Shelby. Hi Josh. Congratulations on the wedding. Shelby was always there in my life growing up, and I'm glad to see her taking this step towards something greater. Good luck to you both. Am I on now? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shelby, I'm supposed to give you advice <laughs> about being married. My advice to Josh is just shake your head yes. <laughs> And my advice to you is just keep him busy. Just let him play golf whenever he wants to and just be nice to him. Like grandma has always been nice to me. Not really. <laughs> so, but that's the only advice I got. I mean, our marriage lasts 65 years. We was always gonna get a divorce but something always came up like the washing machine would break or the furnace would go out. So we had to spend money on that. So it's lasted for 65 years. <laughs> You've been on 65 years for how long? A long time, you keep telling years go on. But... Well, maybe we might have been married longer than that. It seems longer than that. I still think it was 65 years. <laughs> so now grandma's going to tell you what advice she's got for you. <laughs> Hi, sweetie. I'm so happy for the both of you. I love you both. I know it's going to be a special, special occasion, your wedding. I can't wait to see you walk down the aisle. I want you to be happy. You'll always be happy, I know, because you laugh at everything. <laughs> Hey Shelby, Josh here. 
got a message from Julia. She said you were having a bridal shower today. Uh, so I'm sending you this cameo just in case she also got one from Ben Higgins. I don't want to get shown up like I did at your bachelorette party. Um, for real though, I love you. You make me a better person. Cannot wait to spend the rest of our lives together. Um, have fun at your bridal shower and maybe later tonight we can go get some dinner uh, from the money that I made from this cameo.